Was a hairy chest part of the reason an Albuquerque man died? His widow thinks so. The couple was on a Southwest Airlines flight when the man suffered a massive heart attack. His wife says there was life saving equipment on that flight, but it wasn't used. Nancy Laughlin explains. I have so many memories. These are photos of a happy, loving couple on vacations, smiling, embracing. But this is the last photo taken of Jack Jordan. Four months ago today, the 62 year old husband, father, and financial advisor died of a heart attack right in front of his wife and an airplane full of people. I don't want somebody else to have to, to go through that. Caroline says she and Jack were on a flight from L.A. back to Albuquerque. About 15 minutes prior to landing, Jack went unconscious. Caroline says a physical therapist and a hospice nurse on board the plane began giving CPR. She tells us she saw a defibrillator, a life-saving device that shocks the heart back to rhythm, but she says it wasn't being used. When another person on the flight frantically asked why... The female flight attendant that had been there, right up there with us, said because his chest is too hairy. KOAT medical expert Dr. Barry Ramos says time and action can mean the difference between life and death. The defibrillator is really what saves the lives, especially if it happens and you can defibrillate somebody within three minutes. He says chest hair is rarely a factor with the defibrillator not working, and there are razors and scissors included with the device to shave hair and cut clothing and jewelry. Caroline says for her husband, it's too late. I don't expect the airlines or the flight attendants to be nurses or doctors. Not anywhere close. But in that kind of a circumstance, one of the first things that they should be doing is, is getting that AED hooked up. Caroline says eventually they did shave her husband's chest and put on the device, but he died at the Sunport. We did reach out to Southwest Airlines about this. A spokeswoman says they're looking into what happened. Back to you. Very sad. A popular restaurant chain in Albuquerque.